Hi, Hi guys. guys! We're the Puzzle Couple and we're starting a new puzzle. We are! This, this one ought to be interesting. Yeah, this is Edgar Allan Poe. Um, I think everyone is pretty familiar with quite a few of his poems. Uh, so this is really cool because this is actually all the covers of, of, or a lot of covers of the books. I'm not going to say all the covers because I don't know, um, don't know how many books. Yeah, I don't know how many there are out there of his poems and stuff, but this is from Remarks. This is a, the puzzle says made in the USA. It's a thousand pieces. Do you want to introduce the pieces? Oh, sure. <laughs> uh, they're, you know, they're average size, I guess. They're kind of small, but uh, they feel like they're very well made. I'm not seeing any kind of frays or anything on them. They mm. seem pretty solid. Uh, we'll let you know how well they come together at the end, of course. But uh, mm. right now, they also it also came with a little, you know, just a little poster for it. Mm -hmm. So, with all the writing and everything, it seems like it might make it a little easier to put together. I am not sure about that, but um, we shall see. Yeah, down below, if you've read any Edgar Allan Poe, if you have, like, a favorite poem of his or whatever, let us know. Yeah, yeah. That would be kind of cool. Yeah. yeah. Or he does uh, short stories, too. I believe so. so yeah. yeah. So, if... If there's true whatever, stories, yeah, all yeah. those work. Whatever work you like of his, uh, mm -hmm. let us know. Let us so, know. You know, and also like and subscribe to our channel. Uh, hopefully, we're going to be doing this for a long time. And and at the end, we'll give more feedback on mm -hmm. like how the puzzle went, how the pieces fit together, um, and our general opinion of the overall experience with this puzzle yeah yeah if it was super hard if it was not too mm -hmm. hard if it was you know something we would never do again kind of thing <laughs> <laughs> so we shall see so we'll talk to you later guys okay bye bye
guys. Hey guys. So we finished the puzzle and it was awesome. I didn't really realize there were so many different covers for Edgar Allan Poe. And yeah. I think I own like one of the books that was covered on here, but um, since we've packed and moved a couple times, I don't know where all my books are right now, but um, yay, this was so much fun just seeing all the different covers and maybe a couple uh, collections I might want to to uh, nab. Yeah, it was actually very cool. So uh, I enjoyed this one. I like, I like the Remark ones, at least the ones that we've done so far, because mm -hmm. not all the pieces are the same. There's some very strange shaped pieces uh, throughout the puzzle. I mean, you got your regular uh, ones, but you got some that are just very strange. That some of them don't even have like the little tips on them or whatever. They're just, you know, little flat pieces that go right into it. It's actually yeah. very cool. It uh, was. We enjoyed it. This one we got from Bookman's and it was, uh, it was actually all here. Uh, there was one piece that had gotten chewed up by something. <laughs> uh, we don't say what it wasn't these guys it wasn't time. ours this time no um, they only did it one time and ever since then we have been very careful about moving the chairs away from the table mm -hmm. so they can't they can't get they to can't it. get up to the table yeah um they're at the table right now but they're with us so <laughs> um yeah the only thing is is this is the second puzzle that i've done from bookman's mm -hmm. that i'm not ex I'm not really too happy about so I mean we've got we got six more puzzles from them mm -hmm. and so we'll do those and see how those turn out but I don't think I will ever buy another puzzle from Bookman's because they don't vet their puzzles very well before they put them out for marketing or for resale for resale yeah so, especially especially since they're they're not expensive. It's not like a new puzzle. Not that puzzles are necessarily expensive, but uh, they still charge more than what you're going to get at some thrift store or something like mm -hmm. that. So, For this puzzle, we paid $10.50. So that, to me, is pretty hefty for yeah, a chewed-up piece. Yeah. Um, Very much so. But I would consider buying this brand new because I kind of wouldn't mind having this type of puzzle for my Halloween bathroom because um, I, I just really liked how dark and it all the covers of the of Edgar Allan Poe there were so yeah. Yeah, I would cool. consider it yeah mm -hmm. all right guys hopefully you enjoyed uh, this puzzle that we did and we will talk to you next time Bye. Bye.